Oh no, some more, some more, I'm back, bitch, come test me Y'all wanna hate, that's so ugly Can't relate, that ain't my fault What y'all have on last year, I bought Competition, y'all just wishing To give my opinion, that's my mission My first album, top the charts Girl, be quiet so the show can start M to the O to the N, I say what Side to the Mo to the knee, I'm her I, 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 I'm back Bitch, bitch, Mona. Bitch. Some more, some more, Mona. Some more, some more. M to the O to the N, I say what? Side to the O to the N, I'm high. What? What's going on, you are? It's melted up. Melted up night. Yeah, and I'm the ghetto queen on this ACTV scene, keeping an eye on me with the gangster link. Girl. And I'm here to talk to you about it. Baddies Caribbean, entitled, what you say about my mama? <laughs> Girl, who they talking about? Because I know ain't nobody going to say nothing about my mama. Okay? Yeah, but before I get into this video, y'all know what I need y'all to do. I need y'all to get your mother in snacks. That's what my Walking out, how to learn how to get the money, get the snacks. But I need y'all to do, get the money, get the snacks, get, 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 get the money, get the snacks. Y'all don't have nothing to fucking now. Yeah, now y'all also know what else I need y'all to do, right? <laughs> I need y'all to like this video, whore. Like this video, how? Girl, so we here. Dia, we wanna be I. I don't even wanna see her. <laughs> Girl, Dia goes to check on Slim, who ain't really Slim in the booty area, to see how they feel about leaving the show. Don't nobody here. They didn't even care enough to give y'all quality cameras, cause y'all screen looked the real faded. <laughs> Girl, I was like, girl, get these girls off the screen. They're embarrassing. <laughs> no, I mean, like, embarrassing, like, embarrassing, like, cam candy burris, embarrassing. <laughs> girl, y'all know how to spell her? <laughs> I just didn't want to see them no more. Girl, y'all off the show. Why y'all recording this last little bit, girl? And then the fact that ain't nobody else say goodbye to them, it's just them. Y'all kind of miss me with that. I ain't feel like seeing her. I ain't feel like seeing her. Slim says no one spoke up. Dia's like actually me bought dead. And she was in your face when she said it. And she was biting on a pork chop. And you did nothing to her. But you wanted to run up on Diamond and get beat out. <laughs> but no, Dia ain't really say all that. But that's what happened. <laughs> Girl, they still on the show and I'm confused. They talk about their experiences on the show and don't nobody care. Girl, they leaving Puerto Rico. The girl say the PJ to DR is two PJs going. And I'm like, all right, this is cute. I'm amongst the us, because we didn't have the cameras rolling for whatever reason. Anna got into fisticuffs with Mariah, mama them. I don't know how that work out, and I don't know what that's like. But if Anna got into an altercation, a physical one at that, with my mama, she wouldn't be on the show no more. <laughs> Because she would be dead. And I'm talking about for real, though. How you fight my mama and you still walking? My mama would have whooped her ass. So, and my mama like 65-ish or something like that. My mama would have whooped her ass. What? God, I don't know how that works out, but Anna still walking away and all she got is a fraction finger. She wouldn't have had no fingers. She would have had nubs. You know what I'm saying? And they would have been bleeding all over the place. My mama would have probably ran them over. <laughs> yeah. Yes, don't my mama. My mama about that life and about that death. Ah, right, can I get a beep beep? Beep beep, honey. Beep beep on that way. What? Girl, Anna gets on the PJ and she says she fought Mariah's mother. Natalie does a toast to Biggie, big Dominican. 
Anna has to go to the hospital because her figure is messed up. Wouldn't have been me. First of all, if I'm fighting somebody, my figure ain't nothing on me messed up. But if my mother would have fought her, it would have been her arm broken, her kneecap swollen, all that. Her feet smashed. All that would have been jacked. All that. All that. Okay? Girl, what? All the girls get to the house. And the house is really dope. I have to say, it really was looking real nice. I was shocked that the house looked so good. On the calls, Natalie and Tasekki and says that she, uh, you know, she fought the family. Anna says her mom hit her four times before she decided to beat her up. I don't really know how that worked. You know, I really don't. Like, I don't know. How, you only got one time to hit me before I bop you, and I bop you on the ground. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't understand how that works. You get hit four times before you decide to wake up. Anna goes to the hospital. They speak in Spanish, but they got subtitles. And I'm like, okay. She is told to get a splint and not to spend money in a hospital. Okay, I mean, I could have told her that. But whatever. She's annoyed because she didn't want to fight this season. Girl, ain't nobody tell you to run up on nobody, mother. Biggie, Meatball, and Callie. And so I wrote Meatball twice. I don't know why I wrote Meatball. It was Callie, Meatball, Biggie, and Tink. That's what it was. Uh, Biggie says Tink doesn't have a vote because she could have went home. Girl, I don't know who Biggie thinks she is, but she thinks she's somebody this season. But she didn't tell. See, the thing is, she didn't say that to Tink. She said it in the post-confessional. Girl, miss me with all that. Miss me with the shoulda, coulda, woulda. Give me with the present time and day right now. You know what I'm saying? Girl, bye. Anna speaks to her aunt. Anna says um, she beat up the mother. The aunt is looking confused and days on the screen like... Girl, I hope you don't think you calling me down there to fight because I'm not doing it. Am I the only one? I don't think so. Sophia, Natalie, Jayla, Scotty, they all talk about the new bitches and, you know, bring, finally bringing the replacements in, which they have yet to bring them in. I don't understand how this show is working. She talks about wanting peace for once. Um, Scotty wants Gretchen to go home. And Natalie is thinking that she she's saying that she thought everyone was okay with Gretchen and that Gretchen was cool because when she asked everyone who should go home, she only heard Dia and Slim. Girl, don't lie, because uh, your friend that got bite, that got a bite of crime um, taken out of her skin, been wanting Gretchen to go home. But for whatever reason, you still leaving her in this house. I don't understand that. Why is this even a conversation is my question. Why are we still talking about these bras, who need to go, who need to come in. And so what's interesting, and I think it's a setup, Natalie tells Scotty that she has to tell um, Big Gretch that she's going home. Natalie thinks she's slick. She just wants Scotty to get into a fight and she wants to stir the pot. But girl, it is what it is. That's why she the boss, I guess. That's why she the boss. Biggie and Rolly hug each other. They kiss and Scotty and Seki come out. Mariah pulls up, and she automatically is flexing on wanting to fight or not. I don't blame her because if somebody fought my mother, well, not only would they non-exist anymore, they, like, would not be, be, be breathing right now. But if they were, bitch, Big Mona here. Big Mona Simone is here. You know what I'm saying? Queen Mona Simone is here. Girl, where this bitch at so I can beat her up somewhere? Because I already know my mother did damage. I'm about to dig her grave. You know what I'm saying? And Mariah comes on flexing. But we find out that Mariah's mother is the reason I started Is the person that started it. According to Anna, though, mom's dude laid hands. It wasn't just about words. So according to Anna, mom's dude laid hands. So Anna had to continue to flex on her and lay them hands back. Girl, we would never know because we don't know the footage. There's no footage. But it is what it is. And I'm wondering, where is the proof? Callie and Gretchen walk along the water. They're having a good old talking time. Now, where things got misconstrued for me is we sitting here talking. We're talking about girls leaving the show. Gretchen is upset that I'm Callie and I'm having the, the say-so to get bitches out. She wondering who I want out. I'm telling her Bianca. She like, why? Then in the post confessional, she like, oh, I thought they would have been wanting me out, but I'm still here. Then from rags to riches, these bitches start arguing. And it stems from Gretchen saying the N-word cavalierly to 
um, Callie. And Callie's like, well, you can't say the N-word anymore. You already apologized. And you're going to have me as a black girl looking stupid hanging out with you. And you sitting here using the N-word. Now, when things got mis- not even misconstrued, just got confusing to me, was that Callie was using the N-word all day long towards Gretch. Which only probed Gretch to feel like she could use it to Callie. I don't know about y'all, but Callie is mushing this Gretsch girl every which away to Sunday. And Gretsch ain't swinging until the very end. But this episode was kind of lukewarm because to be quite honest, all I want to see is Jayla fighting Callie at this point. And I want to know why that is even a thing. Is Callie feeling like she got to stick up for Gretsch? Like, what's really happening here? What I need y'all to do is leave y'all comments below the video. Let me know what y'all thinking. And, um, yeah. Who is going to win in this fight between Scotty and Gratch? Who's going to win in the fight between Jayla and Kelly? And who's going to win in the fight between Anna and Mariah Lynn? Because honestly, that's a fair one. They both tiny and minute. Y'all leave your comments below the videos. Let me know what y'all think. Later.